Microsoft. Your computer has alerted us that it is infected by a virus and or spyware. This virus may be sending your credit card details, Facebook login and personal emails to hackers remotely. Please call us immediately at the toll-free number listed, so that our support engineers can walk you through the removal process over the phone. If you close this page before calling us, we will be forced to disable your computer to prevent further damage to our network. Error number 2, 6, 8, D, 3. Available agent. Thank you for calling support. This is Jeff. How may I help? Yes, I'm calling because I got this message on my Chromebook stating that it had a virus on my system. Okay. Uh, what else does it say? Uh, Windows has detected a malicious virus on your system. Do not shut down or restart your computer. Contact our certified Windows technicians for immediate assistance. Okay, Mr. Nino, what were you doing on the Chromebook when you got this alert? <laughs> closing a window, and it wasn't anything, like, uh, dangerous to be on. I was closing the, uh, Chromebook web store. Okay. And have you recently downloaded anything from the internet that could be malicious? Um, no. <laughs> You can't, you can't really download anything um, on a Chromebook. A Chromebook is basically just online. You can't really download anything. All right, Miss Ann. And apart from that, like, what is the make of this Chromebook? It's a Chromebook. I don't know what the make of it is. It's just a Chromebook as far as I know. I don't know if there's different makes or models of them. All I know, it's a Chromebook. <laughs> yeah. Okay, no problem. And in case the call gets disconnected, can I call you back on the same number? That is 484-258-5431. Yeah, sure. That's All fine. Right. Thank you so much. Okay. Thank you so much. And uh, apart from this Chromebook, do you have any other computer or laptop with you right now? Nope, I do not. Okay, so uh, what we have to do first of all, in order to check this problem, we have to connect your Chromebook to the secure server so that we can diagnose the problem, okay? And once the problem will be found, I'll let you know what needs to be done, okay? Okay. And how old this Chromebook is? I've had it for probably about a year and a half. It's not that old. Okay, year and a half. Okay. Miss, uh, do you have any protections, any security softwares on this Chromebook? Well, it's kind of obvious I can't download anything. This computer does not download anything. You can't download antiviruses yeah, on this. But... No, Miss, what happens? You should have protections from the server side on the Chromebook, okay? That could protect your Chromebook from all incoming threats from the different websites. Sometimes, you know what, there could be malicious websites as well, where you are surfing for a particular thing, okay? okay. And those infections can get inside your Chromebook if you are visiting those websites. Okay. Yes, might be the possibility that your Chromebook might have received some trojans or viruses from any particular website that you were recently on. I see. Okay, so... In order to fix this issue, we have to activate the securities from the server side on the Chromebook, okay? For which there will be a one-time charge, and there are multiple options in the one-time charge that you can go with. Okay. Either you can go with short-time protection or you can go with a longer-time protection. There are options like one year, okay? Three uh, years of support and five years of support. Yeah, and how much does all that cost per, like, the years? Okay. Okay, the year would be cost you really just one forty nine for ninety nine. If you go with a two year, three year, that will be just one ninety nine for ninety nine. Okay, and if you go with a five year, that will be just two ninety nine for ninety nine. So you can go with a shorter protection or the longer protection, depends upon you which one you like to go with. 
Good lord, you think you guys caught, like, charge enough for this kind of stuff? And besides that, I'm going to go ahead and say this right now, okay? You say, I'm going to ask you this question. You say on your website, because I read this to you, you asked what it said. You said that you are a Windows technician, right? Yes, we are online certified technicians. We do support Microsoft products and services and other leading brands like Apple and Google and Android as well. So Windows, Microsoft Windows is is uh, um, aware that you're doing that, right? Yes, uh, we are online certified technicians. We do support Windows products and services. So like you're not answering my you're not product. answering my question though because I'm asking you does Windows know does Microsoft Windows actually know that you're doing this because if I were to go to Windows like Microsoft Windows about my Chromebook and tell them that I had a pop up yeah. like that come up they would tell me no offense yeah. ma'am but we can't help you fix this because a Chromebook is not a Microsoft product you can't help me fix a yeah. Chromebook. A Chromebook is not Microsoft. You're saying you're a Microsoft product technician. You're conflicting yourself, telling me you can fix my Chromebook. You're wanting to. You are using Microsoft Windows. No, I'm not using Microsoft Windows. Using... Microsoft Windows is not on a Chromebook. A Chromebook is not made by Windows. It's made by Chromebook. It's a completely different thing from Windows. You're sitting there telling me that you're going to fix something and charge me for it, but you can't because it's not Windows. You can't connect to my computer anyway because it's not I, Windows. I just, I just told you we cover leading brands. We also fix Chromebooks. I just told you we do servicing for the Microsoft products and services and other leading brands, including printers, scanners, routers, Chromebook, Kindle, Roku, multiple yeah, I'm sure. Yeah, I'm sure. You know, um, you wanna. You're sitting there on that website saying, like, with the recording, that you'll walk me through on how to fix it on the phone, but yet you want to remotely access my computer. That ain't gonna happen, bud, because I don't trust you. Because you know what? I think this is a scam. I'm gonna call you bullshit. Because I know. There's nothing wrong with my computer because I closed that tab, dude. There's nothing wrong with it. I could restart my computer and nothing would happen. You know, I've had a wonderful time talking to you. And guess what? Your phone number is going to be put on YouTube and you're going to be known as an idiot scammer that I wasted time for. That way you can't scam somebody else. You, not, you know, have a nice day, Mr. Scammer. And, you know, stop being stupid. You know, I ain't going to buy into your bullshit. Bye. Hey guys, um, this was a random pop-up on my computer yet again, and if you guys would like to call and irritate these idiots because they're saying that they're going to fix your computer, but like charge you money, you heard how much he was going to charge me, um, the number is 1-877-293-4440. Have fun blowing them up because you guys should know by now that these pop-ups are freaking false. They don't do anything to your computer. Like I told him, I closed it and my Chromebook is perfectly fine. All I wanted to do was waste about 10 minutes of his time, which that's about how long this video is. So if you enjoyed it, give me a like, uh, comment if you wish, and all that good stuff. Oh, and um... Check out my giveaway video that was just uploaded yesterday. Um, I'm not going to go through the time to link it to every single video that I make. I'll just let you guys know that it's there. Um, the giveaway contest is going until the 1st of December. If you have not entered, go over and check it out. Find out how you enter. Find out what you could win and all that good stuff. If you would like to contact me off of YouTube, you can at my kick messenger, which is brown haired phantom. Anyway, I got to go guys. I got to get this uploaded. I got stuff to do because it's one of those days where I'm going to be busy, busy, busy running around with my head cut off. So anyway, you guys have a good one. I'll talk to you all soon. Be safe out there. Bye.